Hi everyone, welcome to another video from FIFAaddiction.com. This one looks at custom tactics and I'll do a series so that you can choose which video you want to view in the series rather than one long video on tactics. So the first video looks at what custom tactics are and how to set them up. Uh, in exhibition mode you can pick a team. So here we have Brazil and you'll notice in team management every team has a tactic set if you look at custom tactics Brazil default is the one that EA have decided is closest to the way Brazil play and what you can actually do if you like the way Brazil play and you want that to be a tactic to use in like ultimate team or head to head you can save that by there clicking save I've saved it there as custom one Brazil and that means in any game mode I can go to my d-pad and select the Brazil tactic which is exactly what this is I've not changed it at all but we'll go through all the parts of the tactic speed means how fast your players are going to pass the ball and be ready to pass so you'll see from the icons at the top moving quicker they'll be expecting by running into little bits of space whereas if it's a slow speed there will be more of a patient build up and the players will come towards the ball rather than away from it passing depends if you want to do it short or long if you select short your players again will come towards the ball mixed, sometimes they'll come short, sometimes they'll go long depending how they feel see they're long they'll be looking ahead so you can play balls in front Barcelona tend to play like this with uh, short passing organized and uh, free form means organized they stay in there formation shape, so your right back will stay at right back, your right wing will stay in right wing they'll all pass it around in their positions whereas free form they'll all float around pretty much like Barcelona and Spain and you'll find your right back swapping places with your right midfielder and your striker dropping deep and midfielders running past the strikers and your players can end up anywhere really chance creation Again, very similar. You can try not making risky passes, or you can try making risky passes so your players will look for runs in really uh, tight positions and will look for you to attempt through balls that are really uh, hard to get through. Crossing, self foot, explanatory, really. If your players uh, are expecting lots of crosses, they'll uh, try and run to get into the box to get on the end of them. So there, all the players are running, expecting the cross. If you've got little crossing set, players will actually drop to come and get the ball. So even if they're in the box, they will come towards the ed edge of the area to pick up the ball. Shooting, your players will get into a position ready to shoot more often if you have uh, it set to lots and your players will be expecting to shoot as soon as you get the ball. Positioning again, we've been through, but for chance creation, you can change it to your actual uh, default of your team so they could be organized in build up. And then, when it gets around the edge of the area, they can all start moving around and changing the positions so your strikers and midfielders can interchange and change positions defence pressure, this is how people can uh, really press high up the pitch and make it as if there's one or two or three even four players rushing towards you when you have the ball similar to the high pressure tactic that's a default Aggression just means that more than one player will actually press, so it's more like the team as a whole is pressing towards the player with the ball. 
you have it low, your players will just sit back and wait for the, the pass to come. Narrow team, if people attack down the middle or you play down the middle and high width if you like to use wingers or the opponent is actually uh, using wingers so you can stop them defensively and your defender line cover is when your right backs and left backs will cover the centre backs offside trap they'll all move up in a line to try and play the opposing strikers offside we all know how EA likes offsides by millimetres so that is quite effective but if you play a contained deep system it's not much point in having uh, an offside trap so that's the tactics and how to uh, change them and then you can just save them and use them in any mode so that's the one that I saved for Brazil and I'll just show you how to uh, select that in a game This is the ultimate team now. And you can use it online, offline, any mode you want. You can set it at the beginning of the game. So there they are. And that's the Brazil tactic. Or you can actually wait till you're in the game and you, then you can use the D-pad to change the tactic. So we're starting a game, if I press the D-pad, you see there I've got the uh, tactics, there's the normal tactics of the top arrow, and if I go down on the D-pad, I can change to my, that's the default Chelsea tactic that I saved, or the Brazil one that I showed you how to save, and I did one for Spain, <clears throat> and then I created a custom tactic, which I'll show you in the next video. And that's how you change them and you can use them in uh, different modes. So in the second video we'll create a tactic and we'll use it in a game and you can see how the players react to the tactic. Cheers. And I'll see you in the next video.